Hello, hello, and welcome back to another Digimon starter deck box opening video. Yeah, so this, this right here, it actually says up at the top is starter deck 17. There have been 17 starter decks, oh boy. And I have been there for all of them. I have opened every one of these starter decks, although I guess most of those openings are now back on what is now my gaming channel. So there's a lot fewer of them here on this card game channel. Uh, but whatever, might as well uh, open this one now and just keep on doing them in order. So this is the most recent one, the Advanced Deck Set Double Typhoon. So I'm not really sure how I feel about these Advanced Deck Sets. I mean, they're, they're cool, don't get me wrong, and I do appreciate Digimon having uh, integrity that Yu-Gi-Oh doesn't, and it actually gives you a full deck out of the box instead of saying, oh, buy three of this starter deck and you'll have something workable. No, no, no. This is uh, surely a workable deck as it is, but these advanced deck sets are expensive, much more so than the normal starter decks worth, so... Yeah, I don't know. I guess uh, if, if it's worth it, then it's worth it. Uh, maybe maybe they're just that good and the, uh, you know, extra amount that you're paying is, uh, is worth the bother. But, yeah, these have historically been kind of difficult for me to uh, break into without absolutely destroying the box, and I do want to save this box. I have a nice collection of all the starter deck boxes as well. Uh, oh, this piece of tape isn't even centered. What is this? What is this nonsense? There we go. So maybe, uh, maybe I can open this without too much hassle. Yeah, there we are. See, look, isn't, isn't that lovely? There's all this stuff inside. Uh, maybe I can even... Oh, nope, I destroyed the box. I did it! I destroyed the box! No! It's fine. A little bit of, a little bit of tape will, uh, will fix that right up. So, what do we have in this advanced deck set? We do have an adorable little parcel of sleeves here. Digimon card game with a Terriermon and uh, mm, I don't remember what the other Terriermon is called, but yes, we've got, uh, we've got all that and that's all good and cute. I like it. And here is the deck, which I will be going over shortly. Uh, we also have, uh, oh yeah, there's like a a set of special foils or alternate art cards or something EX4. Okay, is that, uh, well, that might not even have anything to do with the starter deck necessarily. It might just be, uh, reprint cards. We also have, oh, the secret pack, advanced deck set. One card per pack. Okay, I gotta know. What's in here? What is the, the secret card in the secret pack? Uh, it is purple. It looks purple. It's Cherubimon! Oh yeah, starter 17 Cherubimon. Okay, it digivolves from Antilamon for three. So this is, of course, in the, uh, the starter deck as well. I think there's a number of different cards you could get in that secret pack, and I think some of them are quite valuable. I feel like this one might not be, but uh, you never know. Uh, I mean, I never know, right? I have no idea what these things are worth ahead of time. Uh, this is a bundle of cards that does not want to, uh, leave its plastic sleeving. Uh, just a second. Okay, so I have, uh, removed these reprint cards from the sleeves that they were imprisoned in. So we start out with the uh, EX4 Kokomon, as we saw. What else do we have? We have Lopmon, that's the other Terriermon. Lopmon, also from EX4. Cute little uh, full art card with uh, all of their Digivolutions down there too, that's nice. Uh, Rapidmon, the BT8 Rapidmon. Oh, that is, uh, that's nice. I like the lightning bolt patterns, always Digimon with the cool foil patterns, I do appreciate it. Uh, Magnamon, uh, starter 17, okay, that is, that is this starter, right? Yeah, this is number 17, okay, cool. I guess there's just more Magnamons, 
Uh, in fact, we have we have two. Why? Why would they make alternate Magnemons when Magnemon is in this starter deck to begin with? Whatever, it, it looks cool, that's what matters. Uh, Fireball, EX2 Fireball. Okay, and a Kaiser Nail from Starter 2. Oh, that, that's an old one. That is a classic right there with stellar new artwork, I might say. That's, that's good stuff, good stuff. Digimon always with that, uh, that artwork. Blinding Ray, BT4. Yeah, this is a cool card, actually. I like that one. Uh, Pride Memory Boost from BT7. Got those, uh, oh, it's all of the D Brigade. Lovely. And a Mist Memory Boost from BT8 with uh, Impmon and Bielzamon and the, uh, the Halloween gang in the background there. Okay, well, this Magnemon is an odd inclusion, but... Uh, there we go. Now we can also uh, take a look at the starter deck itself, and uh, I should also point out that the starter deck came with a uh, a fold-out playmat. So, uh, oh, it's got it's got Rapidmon on it. Yeah, a lot of Rapidmon. Is there anything on the other side? I believe in the previous advanced deck set with Bielzamon. I believe that one was reversible. Yeah, and so is this one. Okay, this one's got uh, oh Terriermon. And, uh, and Lopmon, yes, okay. There we go. Now you know, in case, uh, in case you are on the edge about buying this starter deck, uh, and the, and the playmat is what would have made all the difference. Now, now you know what the playmat is. Uh, also, when I'm finished going over this starter deck, I will be opening five packs of Double Diamond, because I gotta open something, right? Uh, something that is not guaranteed to be in a box. So... Gummymon. That is our our Digi Egg Digimon for this starter deck. Yeah, when attacking once per turn, if you have a green tamer, draw one. Okay, so more uh, more tamer support. And because this is an advanced deck, everything is foil. Uh, here we've got the Terriermon, the uh, the super rare Terriermon with cool little. I don't know what those are. What 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 would you call those little circle? Patterns, sort of pinwheels almost in the foiling. It looks nice, whatever it is. Uh, and it does something else with tamers. Yeah, how many terrier mons we got? We got, uh, we got two. Okay, two terrier mons and two lop mons because this is the, uh, the twister, the typhoon, whatever they called it. There's, there's one of each. Okay, so I got some lop mons in there too. Very, very nice. And, uh, Wendigo mon. All right, yes, the Digivolution, as as seen in Digimon the movie, right? Uh, I got four of those. Uh, here we are. It's not actually super easy to uh, page through these cards when they're all foil like this. Uh, Gargomon, I always liked Gargomon. Uh, eating a hamburger. Gargomon with hamburger. Lovely. Uh, when this Digimon uh, becomes suspended, one of your Digimon gains jamming. Ah, oh, well, I, I guess it could give itself jamming by doing that, right? That's kind of cool. That is an interesting effect, and we got a whole pile of those. So here we've got the Rapidmon. All right, starter 17, super rare Rapidmon with, uh, oh yeah, there we go. Those um, hexagonal patterns in the foiling. Oh, and we've got Ace Digimon. Of course we do. Uh, oh, but we've got another Rapidmon first. Can't forget the other not-super-rare Rapidmon. But it is still foil, just like everything else. There's four of them. Ah, Mega Gargomon Ace. Mega Gargomon, yeah! And again, always liked Mega Gargomon. Actually, that whole Terriermon line, those were probably my favorite ones of that particular season of Digimon. Uh, and yeah, I guess they're they're all getting ace Digimon too now, aren't they? Everything gets an ace Digimon, which is fine. Uh, okay, here's Cherubimon. Is that is this the same Cherubimon that I got alternate art of? Yes, starter seventeen, number nine. It is Cherubimon, a rare. And it looks like there's four of these. Yes, indeed. And Henry. Okay, well there is the tamer that would have been 
uh, mentioned in the other cards earlier, so there, there is in fact a tamer in this deck. I would be surprised if there wasn't. And plenty of Henrys there. Double Typhoon, ah, the namesake Double Typhoon, yep. There we go. Only two of them. It, it is it is truly a double typhoon. And the giant missile. Oh, that's lovely. Okay. Uh, suspend one of your opponent's Digimon. Return one of their suspended Digimon to the bottom of the deck. One of their Digimon can't unsuspend until the end of their turn. Oh, you can kind of two for one them with that. Oh my goodness, it's worth eight. Oh, well, you know, it's, I guess you get it for free from security. That's That is something. And what is this? This is EX4 Terrier Mon. Oh, this is a reprint. Okay. Okay. It's, it's always cool to see them reprint stuff in these starter decks with new uh, artwork. More burgers. Everybody's eating burgers. Terrier Mon Assistant. Oh, maybe this isn't. Maybe this isn't new artwork. Terrier Mon Assistant. This looks familiar. I don't know. I've seen so many Digimon cards. Right, they, uh, they kind of blur together after a while. Uh, and Tealabon also from EX4. And, uh, hang on, what's, uh, what's going on here? It's, uh, oh, it's Willis from BT8. Why do you get the special border treatment, Willis? You're kind of foil, sort of. Interesting, yes. And, and Henry, the EX2 Henry, again, with the, uh, kind of special treatment to it. And is that it? That is it. That is the entire starter deck. Then we've got the, the memory gauges, which are not reversible. And what on earth is this? These are like... Why? Why, why, why are there little punch things? What are these for? Are these memory trackers? Why would you need four of them? I don't know. Whatever. Maybe it explains what they are in these rules that I am not going to read. Uh, but they are all uh, all double-sided. I think there used to be only three rules cards, and now there are four. So they are adding more and more rules to this game. Huh. Well, there you go. You have now had a look through this entire starter deck, and, uh, you know, if it's something you're interested in, then by all means, pick one up. But, double diamond. Random packs. Just chucked into the end of an otherwise normal starter deck opening video. So Double Diamond is kind of old at this point, but I like this set a lot, and uh, let's see if we get something ridiculous. I certainly hope we do. We got something foil in this very first pack Tapermon. So Mega Dramon, yes, yes, Skull Mammothmon, classic. Uh, maybe we'll get something that goes in this, uh, this starter deck, huh? We do have an Iron Fisted Onslaught, and the foil is an Azulongmon super rare. Okay, well, that is uh, that is not purple or uh, or green. So one probably would not put that into the Terriermon starter deck. And I also forgot that you have to pull these open that way. I opened the first pack wrong, Baluchimon. Okay, Nanamon, yeah, yeah, Apemon, Toyogumon, good stuff, good stuff. Uh, oh, hang on, yes. So, Magna Kidmon and Underworld's Call. I think this was a... That was a uh, rare that I didn't open a ton of, if I recall correctly. Maybe it is a short print. Who knows? But what I really want, of course, out of Double Diamond is that special edition uh, Omnimon. That would be... Incredible to open out of five random packs. Incredibly unlikely, but incredible nonetheless, right? Uh, Shoutmon there, yeah, Mojiamon. So, uh, oh well, here's another Underworld's Call. Maybe it's not short printed. And a Huckmon. There we go. And uh, yeah, a couple, couple more packs to go here. What do we got? Let's see if we can get like an alt art or something, or at least another super rare, right? Out of five packs, two super rares would be pretty good, I think. Uh, we got a Goblin Mon, okay. And uh, Pogumon, all right. We have a Magna Kidmon, of course, uh, a duplicate out of five packs. And Gobumon, Bond of Friendship, that's super rare. Well, there is our, uh, our second super rare out of five packs. Again, that's not too shabby. 
Uh, but let's get greedy and ask for even more. So, uh, oh my goodness, we, we might have even more. We might just have even more. These might be like the best random five packs I have ever seen. So, Giga Dramon, Bao Hawkmon, yeah, 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 Howling Memory Boost. So, uh, Rattlestar, what exactly is behind you here? It's a, it is a Biel Starmon Secret Rare. Okay, yeah, these were, uh, uh, again, I don't know if I can show this card on YouTube, but pretty good packs. Pretty darn good packs. I actually, I'm pretty sure I have that BL Starmon. I think I opened it in like the last box of a double diamond I got, but whatever. There you go. So yeah, we've got a uh, pretty solid five random packs and then the whole uh, starter deck to go along with it. Got some cool cards today. Cool cards, gotta say. I I genuinely wonder how they picked these cards to be reprinted, and why I got two Magnemons in this pack. I don't know, maybe there's some randomness to it. Maybe they're not all the same. Uh, but that is something that you will have to tell me if, uh, you know, you picked up one of these starter decks yourself and got different random reprint cards. Uh, but that does bring me to the end of this little, uh, un well, I guess it is literally an unboxing of a starter deck video, and I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, then please leave a like, a comment, subscribe, and I hope that you'll join me again next time for whatever it is I might be unboxing next. I'm, uh, pretty sure I'm going to be opening some Digimon cards this weekend. Till then, ta-ta. There it is, there it is. Well, I asked for an ancient copper dragon, didn't I? Oh, oh, what, 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 what? No, no. This is the card I was looking for. Oh, thank goodness. That is wild. That is absolutely wild. Predaplant, Therion Bull, backup team. <laughs>